for us in terms of um, science and technology is for research and development because the scientists who are going to be based here, who are based here, will continue to be able to provide some of the solutions that we need mostly for the mining sector. I mean, I make an example with one of the areas. We're seeing a lot of mining safety issues around mining and um, we're hoping that part of what we'll be able to contribute with the sector to be able to reduce the fatalities that we see in the mining sector. So, and again, we have um, opportunities for us to use um, innovation in terms of new technologies to be able to do mining in a new way. And this is opportune for us because we're dealing with and preparing ourselves and wanting to implement the fourth industrial revolution elements. And therefore that augurs well with what we are doing here. So it will be something that we can look at jointly with the partners, not only as government, not only as researchers in academic space, but we can be able to look, have everybody looking at what is being produced from the scientists as research work and be able to say this is what we can be able to work with. So the space, it becomes a very good space. I mean, we've seen the manufacturers as well. I shouldn't forget that space in terms of the manufacturers who are locally local manufacturers within the mining sector and this for me it's an exciting opportunity because it shows you that in terms of innovation we are able to bring new technologies to solve our problems. We encourage all our members to export and all of, a lot of them are already exporting and to also move into the neighboring sectors like construction and agriculture because if you can build equipment for the mining sector uh, you can also uh, extend the capability to build machines for agriculture and for construction and other sectors as well. So there's huge benefit in doing what we're doing here.